my name's Ryan, I'm a sales rep with our model waste. Today we're gonna to talk about an overloaded container and what you can and cannot put in a commercial waste container. One of the largest issues that we run in with, whether that's roll off containers or commercial front load, are containers that are overloaded. For roll off, the top of the container is the fill line. So any product that you guys would have or waste that you would have that you're throwing into that container should not stick up over the top of the container. This allows us to easily tarp it and take it down the road to the landfill, or whatever disposal facility we're going to, without any issues of things blowing out or ripping that tarp on the back of our truck. For commercial front load, one of the biggest issues we have are people throwing larger items, such as boxes that aren't broken down, pieces of wood, or other things that stick outside of the lids. This can actually cause an issue where we have problems with dumping the container or having something inside the container hit the front of our truck when we're trying to service your container. In order to reduce these issues, the best rule of thumb is to have those lids on the top of your container easily close on top where you're not having things poking out of the sides or the lids completely flip back with trash piled up on top. Things that you cannot throw in a commercial waste container would be things like paint, other liquids, any appliances that have Freon in them, Tires are also restricted, larger stones, bricks, or anything that may cause damage to the truck when we're actually dumping your container. If you have any questions about what you can and cannot throw in a container, or maybe waste that you guys have and how to dispose of it properly, please call your local office. We're more than happy to help. Thank you.